What a nice girl. So we're on the Dodge limo and it's the next day and we got some plugs in. I stole them from Tom and he'll be by later looking for them, likely. Oh, there he's here. So since we couldn't steal his wires, we stole them off of the 57. And now we're trying to get the points to open. We can see, let me just see if I can pry it. The points are not actually rotating on the little shaft here. They're just bending. So this shaft is seized. So I'm gonna just take the whole assembly out of here. That's what everybody wants to see is the misery. Well, that's right, the drama. The yeah. dr you're gonna slip yeah. and your knuckle will be really, bleeding. Really, what you need to do is throw a tarp under the car so you can yeah, you don't catch lose all the parts. parts. That's actually yeah. brilliant. Yeah. yeah. I was dropping shit in the grass. I had a hard time, you know. <laughs> so I finally smartened up. When I'm out in the grass, hey. Yeah. If you're prepared, then it's not such a nightmare see. when it actually falls. Can we get? Is this? What is that? Well, it's a tiny little screw, but. This is, uh, this is for doing your eyeglasses. Yeah, yeah that's cool. right. And also cool. for chipping rust off your oh, distributor. Oh, okay. yeah. <laughs> just, oh, I'm sure that... You want me a, to pick up some wiper art for, for yeah, this thing blades, when yeah. I get mine? Yeah, because yeah. I'm... <laughs> <laughs> you and me at the same time, eh? <laughs> First thing we gotta do, get the wipers. Get Actually, the wipers can you get like 56 pair, yeah. right? Because I'm sure we need more than... Yeah. These are, you're either right or 180, I think. Well, or, all. well, do you know where you're... There's the rotor. It's pointing okay. to the dipstick, more yeah. or less. And right? we can find, we don't even know if it's right. Well, it's probably right, but... Well, I think it's just, you're just gonna have a gear in your hand when that comes out. Right. Okay, how does it look? Looks poor. Oh, I was, okay, so it's 180, so it's either right or, or wrong, right? Then we know that we won't get it wrong. Now, as long as nobody turns the engine over, but we can't, because you have no battery. Let's just take it in the shop and go over it. Oh, There's okay. basically your problem there. I don't know if it'll focus, but those points are just fried, so. So we can see uh, that was not ever going to work properly. So that shaft is completely rusted i had to use vice grips to get the points off i've never had to do anything like that uh, but they were not rotating at all it was just never going to run so now we're going to see how bad the points themselves are oh yeah that's pretty corrupted yeah not being an ignition expert or anything but i'm still going to say that in my amateur opinion that's not going to run we were going to have a game of the compression is right, except that a quick uh, thumbnail uh, check uh, concluded that the compression is in fact zero. We have one cylinder that seems to have enough to be called an engine, and the other five are just things that go up and down. So we're going to pull the head because that's what we do. That's what we're going to do. Oh, <laughs> that's all fine. That oil thing will have to come off, that'll have to come off, yep. and that mess will have to come off. Yucky. Yeah, and that'll mean we have to start all the way out here with that thing there. And I will burp the, is this, that's a 5 eighths or is that 9 sixteenths? I'll go get that one as well. Okay. And what'd that take us? 14 minutes? Uh, Hang on a second. Uh, why am I? You know what? I'm Let's just pull, gonna pull a few because it's not helping. Pull all. No, what do we care? All over here, then. What do we care? It looks like they're all the same. This one's a stud, so that one will be our problem. We have to go straight up because of this one. So that's what we're going to fight with. It's one in the back. Yeah, that's fine. Ba, ba, da, ba. Oh yeah, we're good now. Fight it all. Okay. <laughs> you got it? I do. I think you're caught, I'm caught on that on battery. I'm multiple things here. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, that's 
see. <laughs> Look oh, at yeah. number three. That's oh, happy. Yeah. That's that's not happy, oh, Raz. I can't believe this thing turns over, man. That's mental. Yeah, <laughs> this was the one that had compression. Yeah. The one. The one. Yeah. The rest of these. Well, now bump it over, or did we disconnect? No, no, we can do that. Are you just gonna shoot rust everywhere? Well, how much worse can it get? Can well, you imagine you if we dump, had tried you starting dump. that? You might dump all this rust into this hole now. Oh, uh, it doesn't matter. The motor's junk. It's all garbage. Although, in their defense, not much of a ridge. <laughs> Keep going. That one, not closing. Hold on, Keep, hold on, you're you got smoking. Fire. That's okay. Sir. Nothing moving. Okay. Okay. Okay, so we got stuck, and the rest of them are moving a bit. This is the only one that's not moving at all. So it's fine. Tappy, we'll have tappy. that working in five minutes. That's just tappy tappy and vacuum and then we'll give it a little bit of the old wire brush and scrapey scrapey and scrape and tack and hack and fucking go. It'll be fine. It's just gonna take a few minutes to clean everything up. And then we'll soak it all down with oil. It'll spin over way better when it's not pushing this around. I can't believe that's not seized solid. With that much rust and garbage in there. How is that not seized? Number two is the champion. Whoever bet number two would have better than zero is the winner. And the rest of it is poo poo. Did this one open? Uh, yes. Yeah, because it would it would seize otherwise. It would just stop. Oh, the thing is, this correct. one opens, but this one never right. fully closes. Right. It's just stuck. <laughs> Let's vacuum it and hit him with a hammer and see what happens. It looks like just exhaust. That's pretty typical. They tend to be drier and hotter and of course lots of access for moisture and animals up through the pipe, right? Mm -hmm. Whereas the intake with the lid on. But this one's particularly quite tight. Particularly bad, yeah. These ones are good. Yeah, all the intakes seem okay. This one's getting better already. That one's on the ramp. Hang on a second, you know what we're gonna do? Let's, why we're, you know, let's get other yeah. stuff cleaned up well, here. At now, time. now that you have a fresh can. Yeah, right. Okay. Oh, just ultimate lubrication everywhere. See how much faster it is already. Yep. Now that it's not just. Hit it again. That one's almost staying down. So these two are the real troublemakers here. This guy. That one's supposed to be up. There we go. Oh, yeah, that, that one's getting better. That down. one's almost down. Yeah, okay. Back to the glamour. A lot of it not uh, too bad, really. Just number three. And the rest of it coming back to life pretty easily, more or less. This is a little, little extra work around here, but really. Everything's moving now. Yep, it all seems to be 
uh, quite functional and the bores we were just looking can we get a quick you know not great but not not no, garbage huge gouges uh, they might even have some hone still in them there you see still some lacrosse hatch definitely some footprints where the ring sat and here you can see some water line multiple water lines oh, yeah. or that's just ring lands so this one was very close to being seized but somehow it didn't seize so that's good this is going to take some cleaning um, do this again. Formula One guys are always stealing my tricks. <laughs> like, how does he get that swirl? Ah. Oh, look at crystallized poo. <laughs> I don't even know what that is. That's pretty harsh. What is that? I don't know, but it'll scrape off. It looks like it's some kind of rust-based product. Looks like there's something on the lens of the camera. Uh, okay. There. Tom and I are cleaning the cylinders out. Do you want to go up and down? Yeah, let's hit it. Okay. How grubby is it looking? Yeah. It's getting a lot better. You can we see that the, the, the oil on the sides now is not all rust colored. Yeah. So yeah, that's good. Yeah. Well, that works really well yeah. actually. Yeah. And then we just take this and we blow them out. There we go. stuff's all hey. like none of these are loose no like this thing if we get it going it should actually it'll run be, okay it'll be yeah. a good engine like if yeah. it didn't have that big freaking crack in it yeah but, exactly uh you know but uh, well, we'll, you, we'll you patch know, it you can patch it Oh, How's nice. the color match? Copper. Oh. It's a nice match. Yeah. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, that stuff stinks, eh? It's like candy. Don't do that. Candy holes. copper. No use in doing the holes. Nope. <laughs> uh, Tom. Waste, hey? Yeah. We'll know. We'll yeah. know. If we don't have enough, we'll know what he did. <laughs> No, flipper? I'm gonna try and. Yeah, I think so. Try not to touch the other side. Yeah, I'm not much help there. You got That's it. No problem. You're in the overspray. Yeah, I know. I was just thinking that. Oh, I'm kind of used to it. Pretty ferocious stuff. Whew. God, I don't like the smell of this stuff. We'll have to get a razor blade and clean his windshield after. Uh, yeah. yeah. Hey, Braggers. Good enough. Well, that's good, eh? Yeah. Looks pretty good decent. Enough. Does it dry or do we I just mean, throw her on? Yeah. I'm just going to use it up. We don't have much left. I would we do might that. We need some around the goddamn water pump or something. Seal up that fucking hole, hole in the radiator hose. <laughs> oh, that's a disaster. What bolts? They're going to be fucking treadmills. Well, no, we're going to look for 45 minutes for four bolts. That's what's going to happen. Oh, yeah. Well, we should be ready to go. Ready? Oh, that works pretty well. good. Yeah, that works really well. Yeah, that's great. Yeah. Which Number one? three. Yeah. It's wetter than all hell. No, Look at that. soaking them down. Yeah, yeah. No, it's okay. Yeah, it's not dirty. Well, it's not dirty, but uh, right. it should be wiped out. Time to put the head on. We don't have all day. Yeah. 
put in the big pieces and the big holes. So the the so old plumber's trick. <laughs> I really think that this will work fine. Well, it should stop the dirt from coming well, out. We're and just not having any luck any other way. This thing is way too dirty. <laughs> way too dirty to do it any other way. Yeah, I think that will be fine. Well, you want it pretty flush. <laughs> Frankers. <laughs> Franker says, what a waste of nice bread. Well, for Christ's sake, the dog's going to eat it all on you. <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna be going to the store soon. Yeah, yeah you need to get some more bread. Yeah. <laughs> this is gonna work. It's gonna work fine. Yeah. And then you know the other thing. Water in it, it just dissolves. Uh, of course. Yeah. Probably lubricate the water pump. Yeah. Well, Tom, are you hitting the button then? Well, oh, oh, you you get the honors to do that, huh? What do you mean? Hit the button. It'll be fun. All right, hit it. Hey, Tom. Did in gear. Oh, I heard something. This thing is smoking. Like, can we just ground it properly? And say, this isn't worth a shit either, I guess. It's too big if memory oh, serves. Oh, she's sparking. Takes seven hands. Tell me right. this thing. Hit it. Shorten out here. Okay, Not stand short. back. Oh, hang on. Okay. A no, we're not, there's no gas. Just a second. There we go. <laughs> okay, coil. Go. Okay. Nice. It did slide oh, ahead. Yeah. Is there any way? Oh, we should check that it's not. Yeah, it's gonna say. Yeah, it was in gear. That's it. It's a good goddamn. Was it in thing gear? You got all those yeah, tires. That's why she was hey. rolling over. Yeah, no, no, it was. It's a good thing you got all those tires over there. That's okay. right. Okay. Hit okay. the start. Yeah. It's gonna go. Pretty close. When she's going like that, Scott, give her a shot of gas then. Do you mind if I advance the timing slightly? Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Where's the... Hang on, just, let's just hang on. Get a vice grip there. Oh, ho, ho. There we go. Now nobody has to. Okay. Okay, it's go time. You gotta be over on this side. <laughs> That's all that oil you put in the floor? Yeah. Rubber up! Whoa! We'll do one more and then we're gonna hook it up to gas. Yeah, it runs yeah. fine. Yeah. I mean, fine being a relative. Okay, coil off. Oh, I, I didn't have the fuel button on. Oh, <laughs> no wonder. This thing is good for mosquitoes. Oh, look at it. Well, I tell you what, that's uh, you too hectic. Okay, go. I hope your neighbor doesn't complain. I hope they let me. Know. <laughs> <laughs> My wife might. No. Just say I got a new sa fabric softener. <laughs> wow. All she right. Rent. Let's, let's rent. rent this fucker out. <laughs> I, I have heard my wife say, What are they doing over there now? And I said, mm, Whatever. <laughs> Yeah, let's hook it up to gas. What do we need? Yeah, well, right. I mean, this carburetor isn't going to do anything until we take it apart. Okay. So I think that at least now it's worth taking the carburetor apart yeah. because it, it will run. It actually, I think we got four or five going there at one point. Yeah, there's definitely some heat in a few of these. Carburetor. The usual, right? Uh, level one. 
scrape the shit off tidy. That's, you know, looks it's nice. all good. It's clean, right? Looks so clean. it wasn't in bad shape. So just a light once over and reassemble. Even accelerator pump still intact. So that's number one, right? If you got that. This is good. Does it squish when you yeah, shove her down the hall? Not, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, Ooh. it'll move. It'll, it'll work. Because yeah, I pushed on it and it fired the ball bearing out on oh, the gravel. Go. There you go. On the gravel. Yeah, nice. well, that was fun. That was how the project started. So now I know where it goes anyway, because yeah. I watched it come firing out of there. So that's good. We're going to assume that works. Good. Da -da, that can go part of that. Uh, what's left? We didn't really even take very much apart on this thing. Well, but we have to make one of these, don't we? Oh, we need this thing goes here. What? Oh yeah, that's this was a failure. The, the surprise uh, forensic treat. And what are you no. thinking? Well, I don't know. We have to do something. A splice. I'm thinking a splice. Really, all we need oh, to do is like splice mm, this curve into here. Mm, mm, yeah, buddy. Mm. That's what we're gonna have to do. Well, that sounds like a fun project. No, yeah, I don't know. Or we just trace what it's supposed to be and cut out a new one. Yeah, you know. Yeah. It is pretty poo. That's pretty poopy. So that never would have run. It never would have run. That's probably why the car got parked. That would have just been lean, lean, stalling, lean. Right? It would have just been crap. Never would have idled below 1200 RPM. Well, it's a major vacuum leak, right? It's just, yeah, there's no way. We should be charging the battery. Okay, well I can handle that. I'll go get that set up and... Uh, then this will be done. Okay. Well, we'll have to figure out something for this, but whatever. I'm sure it'll be very... Okay. Level one tidy on the carburetor. What else? Fuel pump, sort of? Pump, check. Fresh, sort of gas. Okay. Charge battery. Charged battery. We doing her? Yeah, let's hit it. Coil on. Whoa. It's okay. Everything's just excellent. Just standard operating procedure here. Okay. Yeah, but the solenoid's clicking, so. I don't know. There we go. There we go. Take four. Wasn't even we weren't even trying we didn't even i mean that's right out of the box runs great okay um i think the reason i said to shut it off was so that we can double check that there's enough oil oh, and uh and start figuring out how we're gonna put some coolant in it so we can go for a drive looks like steven was left unattended for several minutes what year did you say this thing was? Uh, 67. 67. This thing's actually pretty presentable. A pretty fantastic car. Time for gruesome before shots, ready? Gruesome. Gross. I should have gotten it before I scraped all the light. Yeah, this is the after two days of cleaning. It's not too bad on this side. It's not as bad as some of the cars we've seen here. What did uh, what did we say this was? 67 Saab 96. 96, and this is uh, the big block triple carb. Yeah, the two-stroke. Yes. Yeah. Turbo rear-wheel drive conversion. <laughs> Don't listen to the blasphemer. Don't listen to the heretic. All right, we're gonna push this fine shell of a car into the garage. Husk. This husk, dusty husk. One year. 
right? Well, no, this one is, year. This what is the date? Year. Somebody check their stopwatch. September twenty. September twenty something. Twenty seventeen. Yeah. Finally, one solid color again. First coat of epoxy primer. I guess the only coat of epoxy primer.
it officially Thursday yeah. morning, I guess. Thursday morning? Do you like it? Right? I do like it. There's like the... It? Yeah, it looks fine. It's hard not to like that. This is the black background base coat. We're just going to let it dry for a couple days. Then we're going to start putting tape on it. Uh, really though, uh, all the body work came out really nice. So there's no clear on any of this. This is all just black color coat, which uh, which we will be letting dry for a day or two. Got all the sealer in, and everything fitting very nicely. Looking forward to the fun stuff now. We bought all of our uh, metal flake and candy and silver and lace and all the bullshit. So that well, that's uh, that's what we get to do next week. The games have just begun. Yeah, right. We also bought a lot of clear. found any uh, mistakes so we're happy to move ahead on it. like it's classic tire time again. What do we got today? It's a Pennsylvania Super Aero Lux 760-15 four ply. Looks like about a two and a half inch, no, maybe two and a half inch white wall. Anyway, that's a beauty. I've never seen one before, so I think we should fix it up. So let's start by washing her up. Okay, it's classic it. tire okay. time with me and Dean. Yeah, so as you guys can see, Pennsylvania. Oops. You Pennsylvania. see that? With, with vacuum, vacuum cup <laughs> rim seal. That's wow. what this is, I guess. This is the vacuum cup rim seal. Yeah. Oh, it is a vacuum cup. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <right>. <laughs> Super annals. annals of this is a tire gimmickry. That's right up there. A little goopy goop on the a tire. Goopy. Okay. <laughs> yeah, good. Good stuff. Slide Slop it all in there, yeah. Oh, oh, oh it's heavenly. Yeah, right on. We're almost going to need a 50s hubcap for it now. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'll just stop everything and. Yeah, drop everything. Don't get me out <laughs> right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See you in a few minutes. Oh, so here's how we install the tube. This is. Well, you just kind of have to feel around the. It's kind of a pain. This is one way to do it. There are other ways. Somebody always has a better idea. Right. So Never so. say this is how you do something. Oh, tubes are so handy to have. Yeah. So you have two different sets, of, two different styles of tubes, or no, do you? Just 14, 15. 14, 15. Yeah. Okay. You'd probably get them into 16s as well. For like, because some of the 40s cars, like your Plymouth Road King, had that, right? Like 16. Yeah. Didn't it? Yeah. That's fine. Goop time. Goop time. Right on. 
Wow, that's cool that you found this nice white wall. It's going to look very appropriate. This is from Don at the oh. garage. Oh, Don at the garage. Yeah, he's great. Oh, good. There we go. Just like smooth as silk. There we go. Friggin' A. Come on, Dean. We don't need a commentary. It actually looks good, though, with the white rim. You know, it's fine for now. So, what you put a cap on? Right. Okay, I think that's fine. Yeah. I seem to be stressed out. Okay. You're supposed to take this out first. Because if the tire starts going. It could hurt the. Well, you have to be able to pop the air off and run away. Uh, I see. But if I pop the air off and it keeps all the air in there, you kind of. It's kind of spoiled, right? It's a safety precaution. Well, that's going to look way better. Oh, so much better. <laughs> oh, it's an old girl. It is. Now it has one proper yep. tire again. Good. And that can go there. No, that is a proper tire for the. Yes. I'm so excited. Oh, yay. Put a cap on that guy. Do, 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 do. Okay. Right on. And we're not balancing that. Yet. No way. We're no. Done. Right. Okay. How so. Sweet is that? I'm Let's put that sweet backer oh. back together. The radio is bugging and us. For, we're done. Oh, well, no, we're not done. <laughs> we're not done yet. Uh, yeah, as long as, as long as you get one, you're okay. Yeah. Wicked. Just sucking them down. No. Pretty cool. No. But this looks way better. <laughs> this is like, you know, you're, you got grab this pack or you're trying to gussy it up. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, good. Oh, that does look. Oh, classy. <laughs> oh, oh, that looks so sweet. Oh, Lolo, eh, Bomba. <laughs> I'm gonna have to give you the visor that I got. Oh, yeah. 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 Get the Kleenex suspension. <laughs> oh, the air conditioning thing on the side, eh? That's much improved. I oh, think it's hard to argue that. Oh, so happy to see this. Oh, wow. That's pretty good for midnight auto, eh? Yeah. Way better. All oh, right. Man. That's great. Well, we'll have to put one on the other side here next week. If you can do another wire yeah, like that. Sure. Oh. Yeah, sure. I got another one. All right, here we go. What do you guys think of this? Whoa! Kidding me? Canadian only Canadian icon oh. painted by a Montreal icon. This is a painting by Elton from Retro Old School. And when I met up with him a couple of weeks ago, uh, he was kind enough to sell it to me because I really wanted it. That's a 1961 Monarch Richelieu Canadian model. Pretty rare car. Pretty cool painting. I don't know, is it straight enough there? No, oh, yeah, I'd say it's... The whole rough. building's kind of crooked, so... I mean, I can't tell for sure. Actually, no, it, it, it looks great. And I just, yeah, when I saw this, really this, is, this is amazing. Like, he's got the chrome perfect. Like, yeah, yeah, rare, can, you're not really going to see this... Cool. Yeah. Really, really love it there. You're not going to so, see this uh, ever again. Yeah. This is great. Thanks, Elton. Sweet, man. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Elton has other paintings for sale. If yeah. You guys like this kind of thing. I think, yeah, I'm buying he one. He has a very cool style, and I'm really happy and proud to have that. That's great. It's part of my bar. I'm going to put it up a little higher. Oh, man, that's dope. Yeah, uh, awesome, right on. Right? Deadly, Elton. God. Yeah, right? Now you oh. Can while you're playing the drums. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, 
today, <laughs> today I thought we would try to fire up the limo and maybe even try to drive it down to the house. So we'll see how that goes. So should I fire it up and immediately try moving it? No. I guess. Or do you we want got, to just let it idle for a well, few seconds? Well, we got water in it. I mean, yeah. we, we, we've... Yeah, no, I'm all for letting it idle. I don't care. I'd like to, uh, I'd like to see it run for a few seconds. And, and I'd also like to set the idle speed down a bit. A little bit, It seems huh? pretty fast. Pretty racy. What do you need, a flat or? Yeah, I think there's one around. Yeah, I think there is too. I think the other one would be cranked way up because of that big vacuum leak. There. Thank you. I got one here, Tom. Yeah. Getting brave. I'm going to turn it down before we even. There we go. That ain't hooked up to shit, but we don't need to worry about that right now. Okay, I'll put that on there so it stays a little further away from anything. Let's fire it. I can't believe it. It's uh. It's, it's holding way more water than I thought it would. What's with the shiny new paint down here? Oh yeah. Oh, so, that's pretty nice, eh? Yeah, yeah. it looks really good. Yeah. Nice block repair. Uh, ah, yeah. hook okay. them up again there. Too, yeah, uh, I saw. I saw what I'd done there. Yeah. Okay, you guys ready? Oh yeah. Doesn't need a lot of persuasion, eh? <laughs> Isn't that amazing? We just see if it moves forward. <laughs> Boy, that runs nice, eh? Yeah, I would stand back there, young man. Does the clutch feel like it's doing anything? No, nothing. Eh? Nice. Here, let's try this. You're gonna put her in gear? Okay, hold on. There you go. Uh, okay. Well, we have to jack it up and see why the clutch won't disengage. But it's fine to move it to the... Oh yeah. Yeah, we just have to start it in gear. Oh, oh wow. miles. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. Give us some clutch. No, uh, it's stuck. It is, eh? Oh, that's too bad. <laughs> brake works. Emergency brake works, fantastic. Oh, we can drive it now. Yeah. Still runs on gas. Hey, the brake works, eh? Come on. Fart brake even works. That's work. wicked. So, do you think if you had it in gear running and you put the clutch in, it could free it? Uh, it may or may not ever free up. I don't know anything about these, but we got that a clutch adjusted. Like there's no way really nice, that yeah. that's not disengaging fully. It's just welded to the flywheel. Right. And it could just And it might come loose, yeah. Or, but the thing is with this fluid drive, we could just start it in first and drive it with the e-brake. Yeah. Okay. So no problem. We just need some gas and then we're going for a rip. Well, why don't we just borrow some from the grave leave and then go for it? Clutch working? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Excuse me, miss. 
you like to get out of the car, please? Yeah. So what do you guys think? Do you think it needs a wash or do you think we should just leave it? Bit of a bath. I think so. Vote for the bath. Same old shit. <laughs> 